So this is a stabilization test with the Sony Xperia 5 Mark II uh, and I want to try out if the new Android L11 update uh, improved the stabilization of this phone when uh, vlogging or when doing some videos and uh, yeah, let's see if I'm walking normally here right now uh, through the University of Auckland campus and uh, yeah, let's see if the stabilization is any better. What you might hear right now is that I'm talking very loudly to the phone itself and you might hear some wind noises because there's still no possibility to have an external microphone attached to record via the default Sony application. And uh, you have to use some third-party applications, but you all know that third-party applications don't have this good stabilization mode that Sony provides, so it's even worse than the one that Sony provides right now. And uh, yeah. Uh, the Cinema Pro app cannot handle things like the sun is coming up right now so the Sony default application can handle it and can uh, yeah, put the exposure up or down depending on how much uh, of light is getting here through on my face or something like this but the uh, Cinema Pro app does not have this feature so I still have the issue with the Cinema Pro app not having this feature and uh, yeah, and the Cinema Pro is the only app that, the only Sony application that allows to record audio via external uh, microphone. And of course, I can use third party applications, but again, uh, Sony has an issue with if I use my normal microphone, it's getting too hot, way too hot, and I cannot control the loudness of this. And if I use my uh, microphone in the Cinema Pro app, it's not getting too hot, the signal. Uh, inside it's getting uh, pretty low so I have the possibility to uh, push it up later in post but yeah this is the Sony Xperia 5 Mark II and a little stabilization test with the main camera by the way I'm using a selfie stick so it is possible to uh, use the main camera also for vlogging otherwise I would just switch to the ultra wide if I have to hold it in my hands the ultra wide angle one that has also autofocus but smaller tinier lens and uh, with the main lens at least I have a little bit background blur which I think for vlogging might be a bit of uh, gives a bit more professional uh, vibrant look if you uh, want want it so so now from a quiet park let's go into the city basically in the background you might hear like the train passing by and there's a loud street so is the Xperia 5 Mark II maybe a good vlogging camera after all, after the Android 11 update and if you don't walk too fast but walk slowly like camera conspiracies usually does it. So no action shot uh, where you try to cross the street before the car comes and, uh, yeah, and catches you and rams you off the street. Um, that's a question. Is it really good? So we have like loud cars passing by on the street right now. And I'm not sure if you hear it or not, or if you can hear my voice still. I'm talking directly to the camera and uh, try to speak as clearly and as loud as possible. It also might be a bit awkward, no? If you speak so loud that everyone else is hearing what you're talking about. And if you have a microphone here attached, you can speak a bit quietly and no one is hearing what you're talking about. But yeah, this is also a very interesting test, I would say. So how good is the microphone? Does it improve with the Android 11 update on the Xperia 5 Mark II? Does it? Or not so much? Write it down in the comment section and uh, yeah, I will show you the road still. So go a bit quicker now to test out the stabilization a bit more. So is the stabilization good enough or not for this kind of test? And you can see now in the background here, cars are passing by. Here's the street and here's another street. You can see a crossing behind me. So is this working? How's the sound quality? Can still hear me or not? Let's walk past the street here and uh, let's see how it looks like when I'm walking the bus is uh, driving right next to me. Is the Sony still able to pick up my voice and filtering out all the noise that is uh, present here on the street or not? So it's a nice question. Uh, write it down in the comment section. What do you think about this Sony Xperia 5 Mark II? Another bus is coming. Um, let's see how good it is or how bad it sounds. So this concludes the sound test, I would say.
for the internal microphone of the Xperia 5 Mark II and uh, let's go back to the park to finish this test. So this is uh, the this concludes basically my test of the Xperia 5 Mark II and the Android 11 update and the default Sony application. Uh, my opinion, the tests that I did in the past show also and reveal that there's nothing that has been updated on the Sony side of things so the stabilization is as good or as bad as it was before. I would say as bad if I compare it with other flagship devices nowadays. Uh, Sony is not keeping up in terms of stabilization. But what do you think about the stabilization test video and the sound quality of the Sony device? Okay, granted I'm in a quiet park here right now so it is not of a big of a deal when it comes to like filtering out noises and so on. And of course I have a wind filter built into the phone itself so I can use the microphone with the wind filter that should filter out the wind. But uh, anyway, what do you think about this? Uh, write it down in the comment section. That's everything for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Until the next time. Bye.